Macleod's Fitness here. Um, just chilling for the day really. Um, I start work at six, so yeah, I pretty much had the full day to myself. I've just had a shower mainly because I went to the gym this morning. It was a chest and shoulders day. Um, yeah, it was a good set. Did some cardio at the end as well. Um, but today's video is I want to explain like how I've gained my confidence and like how you can build it up like because I'm still not really that confident in front of a camera is where I struggle mainly um, as you can probably tell but there was a time about six months ago where I would not wear shorts to the gym or anything along those lines um, mainly because I was just ashamed of my legs and how they were but I've kind of given that of a kick up the ass really um, the more I wear shorts now the more confident I get so yeah it's alright it's alright there's just my cat there she's just chilling um, I'm actually in my mum's room well mum's room when she stays because this is my place so um, it's the brightest room in the house really so I thought it would be nice and it's lovely weather out there but I'm stuck inside I creep but yeah I um, did some bench press um, along with what did I do I did um, like a pec deck sort of thing when you bring your arm all the way out and all the way in um, chest press machine um, both low grip and top grip um, and I did some shoulders as well I um, did a military press not that strong on that um, I've lost a lot of weight on that one um, I used to be able to do 9 reps for I think it was 40 kg. Um, I did 4 reps today, not 9, so a bit disappointed with that, by the way. But yeah, it was, wasn't was too bad. Um, could have been a lot worse. But um, then what did I do? I did. Um, around the world with 7kg um, which was alright I did 3 sets of that and then I went on to 8kg and did 8 reps so that was pretty decent um, then I did um, like shoulder press but I brought it inwards um, I did 14kg for that for about 10 9 reps so yeah it was a pretty good set overall but what I wanted to talk to you guys today is how I built up my confidence because I haven't really been a confident person never have been probably never will be fully confident in myself but it comes to a point in life where you've got to just realise just don't give up um, yeah like if people don't like you not everyone in life is going to like you so no matter how hard you try and please everyone, you're just not going to. So, my advice is just be who you want to be. Like, I'm a double amputee and I don't really care what people think about my legs now. I um, take it on the chin. If they don't like me for me, they can basically get out of my life. Um, but if they do like me, then obviously friends, you know. I'm not ever going to turn anyone down. Um, if they need help in the gym or anything like that I always help out so but the way to build your confidence up is just do things that take you out of your comfort zone so if you want to message a girl or something and you don't know how it's gonna go just message them um, if you want to um, get to your next stage in the gym and put some more weight on the bar and hope hope that like make sure you got a spotter but see if you can do it um, or do a few more reps or do another set you know it's things like that 
that could help you out. Um, what other things like just socialise a lot with mates? Like that's what I struggle with quite a bit because I'm working all the time and I go to the gym on my own, so it's a bit difficult. But if you want to do it, you'll make time. Like there's 24 hours in the day, and as Arnold Schwarzenegger said. You only need to sleep for six, and if you're sleeping for eight, then sleep faster. Because you've got 18 hours in the day. Let's say you work for seven or eight hours. That's still 10 hours. That you could go to the gym, you can meet up with mates. You can do a lot of things. So, this is just a quick video. This will be out tomorrow. Um, you've seen where I have, haven't have been, or have been. The reasons why I haven't been here. Um, so, yeah. I'll hopefully see you guys soon. Might be able to get some more gym footage soon, depending on what's what my schedule's like, so but yeah, always plan ahead. Like what I find is people with nine to five jobs, they're like, oh how how can I go to the gym? Because you just don't have time. Well, I think that's easy, you know? I my gym opens till ten, so if I had a nine to five job I could literally just go straight after work. Because obviously it's what I want to do. I'm motivated to do it, so I would do it. But it seems so my shifts are random. I have to plan it in advance. And some days I can't make it, but because I work two jobs, so they like come in together, and I don't finish until ten. But if you want to do it, then you just gotta make up for it. Like you gotta put in the time if you want to do something, and if you want to go after something, just do it. Just don't give a Thing what anyone else thinks because the only person who's going to miss out is you and if you miss out on that opportunity then you're just going to regret it for the rest of your life anyway stay positive guys and i'll see you in a bit